Yeah, I didn't want to do any fancy stuff and hiding bikes or whatever. You saw the title. I bought the bike. This is my brand new Harley Davidson 2024 Lowrider ST. So we just picked up the Lowrider ST. Sergio was kind enough to help me make this, this dream come true, make this deal all come together. Uh, so huge shout out to Sergio, huge shout out to the Bergen County Harley Davidson team here for making this happen. This is the first one that they received. Hopefully, you know, hopefully I'll be the only one for now. Right, <laughs> right. More of them start arriving. We but don't have anything coming in yet, so. Yeah. Uh, I'm excited to have this man. Um, we'll do a quick little walk around and, and then we'll take it for its first ride. <laughs> All right. <laughs> first initial ride on my brand new 2024 Harley Davidson Lowrider ST. FXLR ST. Look at this beautiful badge right here. Love that branding. I know a lot of you guys right now must be asking yourself a lot of questions. A lot of questions. <laughs> Trust me, I'm asking myself the same amount of questions. I'm happy. I am happy, I'll tell you that right now. So smooth. Something about being on a Lowrider I've been doing so much talking about low riders, my old low rider in particular. You guys could kind of tell that I was really, really missing that bike a lot, man. I really was. Um, but being that I went down that road before, I did a low rider as thing already. I I wanted to go back to that format, but take it up another notch. And this was. This is the next step that I mean that <laughs> this was definitely the next step what really sold me on this bike was also the paint job absolutely beautiful this paint job is freaking beautiful man like and, and believe me when I tell you pictures and videos it does it no justice you really got to see it in person and see all the little details uh, on the tank badging uh, the badging on the front fender, just the, the paint as you see it go from that brownish wood color with the red pinstripes, it, it's, it's, it's really nice. There's also a bunch of flake where it has the, uh, that brownish, goldish, warm tones. Um, a lot of flake in those colors, which is something you can't see in photos. And it's so nice, man. So um, obviously what we'll do an actual review of this bike as well. We're gonna be reviewing my bike. What's up, man? The first initial review of the uh, Lowrider ST and Tobacco Fade, which I haven't seen up. Yeah, I don't think anybody's done a review on this bike yet. So hopefully um, we'll get that done for you guys this week. Go over all the little details on the bike. Tell you right now, it just, it, it feels so good to be on this little Rider ST, man. Like, I, I feel at home. I feel like I never left. So, so comfortable. The whole ride position is super, super nice. The bike is really nimble, which is uh, one of the things you got to love about this bike. It's, um, it's basically a sport touring bike. Super nimble. Packing a ton of power with that 117 in it. Um, basically a mini bagger. That's that's what this bike is. Oh shit. Now I know a lot of you guys are going to be asking why did I do it? 
Do I still have the Road Glide? Um, what are the plans for this bike? It, I, whatever questions you have, just jot them down below right now. I, I want to read everything. Um, also, let me know what you guys think about the Tobacco Fade paint job. Do you like it? Do you hate it? Is it not for you? Every customer that was walking into the dealership when this bike was on the showroom floor could not walk buy this bike without asking hey what is this what is this like what paint job is this i've never seen something like this it's um it's definitely an eye catcher to say the least one thing that i uh, i never really complained about on my lowrider s was the suspension and it feels really comfortable on here yes stock harley suspension that's actually pretty good. The one on this bike. Definitely. And I know this one is uh, has a bit of an upgrade. The taller rear shock in the back. And I know that when they first came out with the Lowrider C, they changed the suspension on it. I mean, it's still a mono shock, obviously. But now you're going to have a taller ride height for the rear. So a lot more comfortable. <laughs> you know what i think we uh need to stretch her legs out we took the local way home when we should have taken the highway so nimble man so so nimble You know what they say, right? Break it in how you're gonna ride it. That's exactly what we're gonna do. All right, so we'll head home right now and we'll finish off with a nice walk around on the bike. Hurley Davidson. That's it, man, she's home. Uh, I, I, I really don't know what to say. Um, I'm at loss for words. I'm super happy. I feel like I'm back home. And it's just something about this bike right here. Such a beautiful paint job. And I, I, I don't know if you guys can see this on camera, but there's so much flake right here. Um, this might be better to see it on the bag. But there's flake all over here. And it's so insane. You can see the pinstripes, just the way everything breaks up. It's just such a beautiful paint job, man. Like, it's something that, it looks retro. It looks classic. It just, really, really nice. You got that HD badging right there in the fender. Really nice. And then in the back, we're going to have the uh, Enthusiast Collection badging. <sighs> I like it. Yeah, Every time like, I look at it, I want to laugh. Like I just, it puts a smile on my face. And I'm super happy. Um, I can't wait to show, to go over everything that I got planned for this bike because yeah, it's a beautiful paint job and yeah, it looks awesome, but it, let's face it, it's too quiet, number one. <laughs> so we gotta get an exhaust. We need more power. So we need to put a nice cam into there. So I'm not sure what cam we're gonna go with. We've done SNS, we've done fueling. So I might wanna do a different cam on this one. Um, yeah, but for right now it's, it's too quiet and, and we, we, we need to change that up. Besides that, I have a full list already of things that I wanna do to this bike. Bunch of upgrades already. So there's a list like yay big, yay high. Um, <laughs> that's it, man. Uh, if you guys want to see more content like this, you're definitely in the right place. Go ahead, like, comment, subscribe, hit that bell button. Doesn't notify you anytime I upload any type of new content. And like always, let the force be with you. Ride safe and enjoy the ride, baby. Peace.
Thank you.